Hi everybody, welcome to Japanese Cooking Lovers. I am Yuri. I am in Kawagoe. It is, it is my hometown, one of the department store uh, entrance. And I'm going to walk to the uh, station and I'll show you um, lots of stores around. I just purchased this um, taiyaki and I will I will eat it. So this is I've never had the uh, sweet potato taiyaki before, and sweet potato is popular um, food around this area. That's why they have it, and they had a new one that's. Um, sweet potato and uh, whipping cream in it, but I didn't buy it, plus I try not to eat um, dairy, so this is, I guess, it's not totally vegan because um, the um, outside they may use dairy, but um, at least um, inside it's same as uncle that um, they don't have dairy in it, and tastes good. It's not over sweet, um, still very creamy um, sweet potato, but I think I still like the uh, azuki one better. However, it's 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 very popular because um, taiyaki itself is popular food and popular snack, and I see lots of high school students and women and even men coming over just by it and. Um, walk away. I don't think people eating on the street like me and um, walking and eating, uh, it's usually a taboo. It's no no thanks in Japan. Um, but it's it's pretty good. It's cold day so it's very good tasty uh, snack here. Now I came over to um, tofu shop and I will show you how is Japanese tofu shop is like and this I've never seen this tofu shop before but it is very very cool. My mom's favorite um koshigaki. And actually this is sweet potato here and this is rice crackers and actually this is um, okara which is the um, uh, soybean powder uh, crackers this is fugashi it's a gluten um, sweet that's tofu and soba udon and dry stuff inside and half dry it's almost dry but it's dry half dry food and quinoa this is um, the flour from um, soy and this is the um, soy meat and this is a color that I already made uh, in my video and they they made and pack it and they sell those things and this is um, tofu and fried. And this is my favorite too. And this is gumbo that they have put some veggies and uh, seaweed. And it's made from tofu and fried. And this is substitute of the uh, meat. That's tofu. And lots of tofu. Kind of tofu. 
they said they came from Kyoto. That's what I made also the other day. I used salmon, but this is sardine. And this is sushi. That's I also have video that um, Inari sushi. And roll sushi, that's they already cut it. So you can make it. It's like 350. It's about three dollars for one roll. This is special Japanese New Year's food, and uh, you can order uh, this one ahead, and they gonna uh, pick up this day, which is December. And this is special for Jap uh, New Year's Day. And that is too, and this could be too. So. This section has lots of New Year's and kimchi and um, natto too. Tamagoyaki. So that's egg. That could be the uh, New Year's food too. Yes. This is one pudding. This is a sweet section. That looks very good. <laughs> and potato salad and gyoza and dumpling. And they have curry too. And then this is meat substitute. So that is uh, tofu, made by tofu. And this is looks like just like um, chicken fry, but actually made from tofu. And this is this is too. This is looks like meat, but they made from soy. This too. This is pretty good. They made this noodle by um, soy. Later day, I might have to come back and I will I will show you what I buy next time. Yeah.